Hi guys, it's Penny from Facebook. I'm Hull Harley on Facebook. Um, this is my first blog, so I'm really, 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 really nervous. So forgive me if I stammer or stutter or pause. I'll try and edit this as much as I can, but I am doing it from my iPhone, so it's a bit, uh, I don't know, iPhone-ish. Um, so yeah, this is my first, it's not a blog, it's a vlog. Vlog? Is that how you say it? I don't know. Anyway, so here's what I've been doing this past week. Enjoy. So, to start off, I have been in preparation of making my Infinite Crisis Harley cosplay. Um, this is planned to be debuted for MCM October, which is London. It'll be my first time in London. I am super excited. Um, I'm only going to be there the Saturday, Sunday there because I'm having to travel through the Friday night into the Sunday morning because I live all the way up north in Yorkshire. So this is what I have been doing. So I have been working on my onesie. Um, <laughs> this is, it looks real stupid because it is for a fairy gorilla onesie but it's not what I'm using it for and um, the pattern's pretty simple it's just a basic onesie pattern if you haven't seen the infinite crisis Harley um log on to my page so, it's a different I've realized doing this vlog I yak 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 on and I was talking about the infinite crisis Harley onesie so I'll dumb it down a little the reason why I chose infinite crisis slumber party Harley as a cosplayer was because it's a onesie and it's going to be packed and it's going to be full of amazing people and I want to be as comfortable as possible. Um, Arkham Knight Harley, the cosplayer I do there, is an awesome cosplayer and I love wearing that costume but I do get hot in it and my body does get hot in it. So I chose Infinite Crisis Harley for pure comfort reasons and plus she looks super cute in a onesie. Um, and I'm super excited about having a teddy bear mallet as well. Um, so yeah, that was my Infinite Crisis Harley. So as we can see, I'm in this process of Infinite Crisis Harley, the horrible process of cutting out and pinning and cutting your material and oh, I hate that part. But I said to myself, I wasn't going to buy a onesie because it was pretty simple to buy the onesie um, if anything it's a lot cheaper to make it yourself and the dress patterns are pretty easy to follow if you know your basic rules of sewing I've only done GCSE sewing I haven't done any degree or any extra classes I've learned by hand so Pre I've also been making something extremely I've just showed you a sneak peek I've also been making it something extremely cute and here's a hint and I'll show you another hint. If you don't know what this is, this is a very, very tiny, tiny Arkham Knight Harley cosplay for a five-year-old. How cute is that? I've had to uh, really work hard on this cosplay because of the whole... This area for the Arkham Knight Harley. Um, she does wear a harness. It is uh, a bit of a raunchy harness. Um, she does show her cleavage. Um, this baby cosplayer is five. And so I was a bit, yeah, it was a bit too much to do that. So what we're doing with this cosplay is we are, instead of like my harness is leather, we are giving her a, an elastic harness. Um, we're not giving her the choker and um, we tried the choker around her neck and she wasn't comfortable and we want her to be comfortable she want she wanted to cosplay this this type of cosplay after seeing mine which is dead cute but um so we're gonna not give her the dog collar we're just gonna give her a normal elastic harness and um, she is not wearing a bra or anything that would suggest to show her chest because she's only five she will be wearing a t-shirt that is red and black with her as you can see it is just a basic cotton shirt it's not it's not like mine is it's not it's it's just cute it's not anything 
like the adult one. We don't want, we want people to recognise that it is Arkham Knight Harley, but then recognise that she is only a dinky dot and um, we need to keep those boundaries separate. Um, she's also cosplaying at MCM Birmingham is when we'll be debuting the baby Harley and she is also cosplaying as Tinkerbell. Um, that was one of the rules. She said she wanted to be Harley and she wanted to be Tinkerbell. So you will see her. I am bringing her to MCM Birmingham in November and you will be able to see for yourself baby Harley. And um, she's cute as a button. She's got a bit of sass. She'll tell you off and she really hates the Batman. Top girl. I'll show you this. Chocolate. I've got chocolate stars. Chocolate stars. I love my chocolate stars. Yes, I love chocolate stars. Um, just something random. I just threw it in there for you all. Uh, what else have I been doing this week? Practicing my Harley voices. And this is something that is very much requested on my Facebook pages. Um, I've done a couple of Skype sessions with a couple of people who have uh, celebrated birthdays and um, very special occasions where I've done the Harley voice for people. Um, I don't mind doing that, as long as it doesn't get a bit creepy pasta. Nobody wants to see that. Um, I don't do it all the time, though. I only do it for special, special cases. So if you've been one of them, you've been very, very lucky. So anyway, the Harley Quinn voice. As you can see, I am from Yorkshire. I am from Hull, so I sound like most contestants from Jeremy Kyle. Um, personally, I love my accent. I think it's awesome. I sound so common. We eat things like pa patties, patty butties. Have you ever had one? You ever had a patty butty? No, because you can only get them from Hull. We are the only city in the whole of the UK with white telephone boxes. Everyone else has red. Another awesome reason to live in Hull. Oh, another awesome reason to live in Hull. I live there. Oh my gosh. So, hi. You're still watching. I'm very impressed. Um, I haven't bored you to death. So, we are going to do the Harley voice. Um, basically, she says a hell of a lot to people other than the Joker. Maybe sometimes the Joker as well. And um, she calls people sweetie. She tends to patronize, not intentionally, in a sweet way, a lot of people. Now, I have written fan fiction on Harley Quinn for a long time. Um, I've obsessed with the character for a long time. So I'm kind of comfortable with her character. I know her personality. I'm quite confident in knowing how she would react in front of different characters. Um, so the voice, once I had the voice, um, it's pretty easy to, uh, it's pretty easy to, um, to, fuck all the words. <laughs> Um, <laughs> portray, there we go, we'll just say that word, I don't know if it was the right word, um, so yeah, she tends to say hi sweetie to a lot of people, um, I tend to use this as a trigger for my Harley Quinn voice, so a lot of, when, if children approach me for photos, a lot of them are going, hi sweetie, like that. Now, when she's talking in a squeaky voice, imagine she's a squeaky boy and not a squeaky girl, and she's at that teenage age where her voice is trying to deepen off, but it doesn't. So you have to squeak your voice. <laughs> I went, yeah, at that teenage age. <laughs> oh my god, I'm being weird. <sighs> um, yeah, so she goes, hi, sweetie, which is... A really high pitched high and then sweetie is like she never pronounces the t's properly she doubles them up as a sweetie like a sweetie so it's like hi sweetie that's mainly pretty much how it goes now the more i do this the more i can get it 
as close to what I'm happy with a lot of times, especially if I'm filming the impressions. Um, I'm not happy with the way I film it. When I'm talking, I can just pop on and it, it, it normally just comes out. So I'll do a couple of impressions right off the bat to show you how hard it is for me to get them like spot on. Right, Harley Quinn impressions. So I normally start off like this. Hi, sweetie. Um, normally the people are quite shocked that I've spoken like, how you doing, sweetie? That type of thing. Um, things like, there's something about that chin. And it depends what type of Harley you I tend to be. If I'm dressed in original universe if Harley, surviving. which is my first blog, if you made it to the end, um, please keep in touch. Comment below and um, follow me on Facebook. Um, facebook.com slash Hull Harley and you can see more. Okay, good.